Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, welcome back to my channel. Um, so today, I'm um, going to be taking you guys with me again to my uh, eight, or 9 to 5 job or however they say it. But um, I have, I think, I had 185 stops with like 280 packages. So basically, I'm going to go ahead and um, take you guys with me, show you little tips and tricks that I usually like to do that makes things go a little bit more faster. Uh, and it helps me out because that way I finish on time or either I finish early. Also, uh, one of the things that, well, at least I was trying to do um, with my channel is I want to post at least twice um, a week. Um, but this week, of course, I ended up getting sick. I feel like everyone now is getting sick. So, um, and I'm barely just getting back to normal right now. So reason why I haven't either uploaded a video but um, I'm gonna try to shoot probably Monday Mondays and Wednesdays for probably when I'm gonna go ahead and make a video um, it might be like one of these videos where you know I take you guys with me uh, to deliver packages for Amazon or um, I might just do some other ones yeah sometimes I'll do like a, either a DoorDash or I'll do other apps just to kind of make a little money on the side since I usually now have Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off. So one of the things that I'll do is uh, I'll have all the envelopes here up in the front just so that way it makes it a little bit more easier and as times go I'll like I'll set them up for like the same street and uh, I'll put them I'll separate them so that way I kind of know and then I have all the boxes in the back and then one of the things also was <clears throat> like for example here what I have um, so I have an envelope and then I have a large box. But if you see it says not in a bag, basically that means it's gonna be your overflow. So it's gonna be all the boxes that you have. So for example, this one tells you exactly what bag it is. So it's like 242 Navy. So that's gonna be the bag that you look for. And then it's gonna be envelope. But of course I have all the envelopes here up front. So I'll have them up here. And then this one, the one that says large box, not in the bag, that's gonna be in the back. So you'll be able to go ahead and look in the, in the back. So that way you know so that's one of the things that you also want to keep in mind um usually they'll show they should be able to show you this while you're training but like i said if you don't well now you know uh, what to look for so also another thing um that kind of helps you identify what package you have you know of course you can always go based by uh the the address that you have um but you can actually go ahead and see if you see here on the phone it has basically like 
numbers right here, 8005, 8006, uh, and then 8004. Those numbers are also here on the pack. There's a little sticker. You're always gonna have this sticker here. And if you see here, it's 8004, that's gonna be one of the packages that you're gonna have to deliver. So if for whatever reason, the address is blocked off because they usually put this sticker here at the address and they'll block it for whatever reason. You can also look by this number as well and that's gonna go ahead and help you guys out look for it. And you can also organize it so that way you guys know which one's coming up next. Um, you know, if you're kind of like that person that likes to organize things like myself, you can also go ahead and do that by the number here. Also guys, don't forget to also uh, like this video and also subscribe down below. And um, also hit the notification so that way you guys know when I'll uh, post videos. Like I said, I'm gonna be trying to do a Monday and a Wednesday um, at least two times a week. If not minimum, I at least want to do at least one video a week. Also, another thing that I forgot to mention in my uh, first video. Uh, so these are these are going to be, of course, the two apps that you're going to be using. Amazon Flex and uh, Mentor DSP. So basically the Mentor, what that is, is basically they're going to go ahead and see how your driving is. So here, it's going to show you, of course, the overall and then here what you can improve on. Uh, of course, my acceleration is probably one thing that I need to improve on, but braking, cornering, destruction, I feel like that's always going to be like that because you're getting your phone, you know, basically, you know, in and out. So I feel like that's always going to be like that. I, I don't, I think basically all my coworkers also have it too. There's not one that doesn't have it. So I feel like that's going to basically be the thing, but you know, speeding, cornering, all that, that's going to be a big factor on it. Um, so my score right now is at 684. Uh, like top 10% are 845 and then of course I think that's um, our station which is 703 so that's where we're at right now but uh, for the most part um, I'm kind of I did pretty good yesterday I didn't really do that good I, I had 552 but uh, I had 692 the other day and then uh, these two days it was pretty good I had 782 and 760 so I mean it kind of depends too if you have a, a lot of packages um, you know you'll want to try to finish as quick as you can so of course you know you might have a, a couple of things that are poor but for the most part that's the way um they'll check to see how you're driving is so you want to make sure you keep that in mind as well that while you're driving you want to make sure you're driving safe probably another thing that also um, i would probably recommend because you're going to be driving for a while so i mean depending some companies eight hours sometimes it's ten but um definitely bring like um some snacks or something rather than you know buying them outside because one you'll spend a lot of money and most of the time you'll probably end up just getting something bad like today i'm actually i got my energy drink today um and um i'm trying to come back a little bit but sometimes i need it just for, uh, to get that little boost to uh, finish all these packages but i mean obviously that's not the very healthy stuff and then some candies as well that I usually end up uh, eating as well so like I said you know sometimes <laughs> not very healthy stuff but like I said I probably would recommend just you know getting some stuff and either from the store grocery store and then just pack them as you go that's probably gonna be the best thing because you'll definitely gain weight um, doing this because even though you're up and down but you're also gonna be eating out like right now going on my lunch so probably i'm gonna end up eating uh chick-fil-a so that's one of the things that you probably uh, not too healthy too but like i said you know you want to plan stuff out when uh when you go and take your lunch or even some snacks as well all right guys so just finished right now just um dropping off the van uh, before I, you know, leave and everything, I just want to make sure and I just uh, want to say thank you so much for watching. Uh, another than that, make sure you smash the like button. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already.